Hi guys, uh, okay, in this video, we'll look at how we can change uh, this Jetstream default logo from the registration process and uh, also here uh, after we log in. Let's go ahead and check. Uh, after this login, we can change this application logo. So yeah, let's go ahead and check our application. This is our fresh Jetstream application from our previous videos. And um, if you, uh, so the first thing is like, you need to publish the views for your Jetstream app, which you can do, you can just go to jetstream.laravel.com and you can find all the helpful documentation here. Uh, you can just copy this command and uh, you can paste it in the terminal. Let's go ahead and publish these views. Okay, so all the views are published here. So once the views are published, you can just find them in resources, views, and vendor directory. So here in the Jetstream, it actually published component and it also published mail. So this logo is actually a component here. So you can see like authentication card logo. So this is the logo here. Let's go ahead and remove it and see like if it works. Okay. And let's log out this and go to login page here. Okay, so yeah, it is removed. Let's go ahead and put our own image here. And I have an image here in images and profile. And actually, let's go ahead and give it some width. Maybe 128 pixel. Let's go ahead and refresh this. Okay, cool. So we get our nice logo here. So the same thing you can do with the application mark as well. Let's go ahead and now log in. And let's change this guy. So to change this guy, we need to look for application mark actually. So let's go ahead and replace it with the same. So let's go ahead and change this to 164 pixel actually. And see if this works. Okay, cool. So this works. So yeah, uh, so these are the two things that you need to change uh, if you want to customize this Jetstream logo. You can actually change the application mark if you want to change the application logo and authentication card logo, you can change this as well. So now if we log out and go to register, you will get this logo here as well. And if you go to login, you will get this logo as well. And also once you are logged in, uh, you can check here. You can see that your logo is here. So yeah, uh, that's it for this video. Let me know if you have any question or comment. I will try to address them in our next video. Until then, see you. Bye-bye. Cheers.